guys, my name is Naninga Koe and welcome to my YouTube channel. Please subscribe. Now before I get any hate for wearing this wig, I know you guys are wondering like why the heck is she in a blonde synthetic wig? <laughs> I'm doing it for the views guys, for the views. I've seen people do crazier things for the views. Now let's talk about the truth about YouTube and YouTubers. Like the truth what i've discovered okay in my personal opinion not everybody's personal opinion opinions differ guys so i'm going to talk about the truth about youtube and youtubers from my perspective so a quick background yeah a quick background about my history with youtube so i started my channel back in 2009 guys 2009 like that was like how many years ago that was like 11 years ago and i think i'm not even sure whether it was 2009 it must have it might have been 2008 when youtube kicked off like when youtube just started that's when i registered my channel but i'm telling you i never posted eh? I only used to go watch Michelle Fan, subscribe to Ray William Johnson, Sidri, subscribe to Sidri Mosh, you know, those, those early, early YouTubers. Yes, I followed all of them. And I'm telling you guys, I always used to want to post. Like, me starting to post in 2020 is crazy because I've made like 30 videos <laughs> and never uploaded a single one. Not even one, guys. 11 years later is when I'm uploading like I just used to be a serial commenter and a serial liker of videos for a full 11 years like I've given people views guys what I'm saying is I've given so many people so many views it's heartbreaking <laughs> and uh, the most heartbreaking part is that i always wanted to start my youtube channel like to upload videos and content because i did have the knowledge i did have the know-how of so many things and i just wanted to like at least you know boost my country yeah <laughs> patriotism guys patriotism patriotism is not dead <laughs> so uh, when i started uploading let's start with the reason I never ever uploaded like between 2009 all the way to like 2019 or 2018. I'm really regretting because right now they've raised the watch hours. Eh? But anyway, so <clears throat> the reason I didn't upload eh, is the first reason, which is the absolute truth <laughs> about YouTube and any social media platform. There's always trolls, there's always haters, there's always people who, you know, are not kind, there's always people who are not positive. Let me not use the neg negative ne words. There's people who are not positive, there's people who are not, um, who are not kind. So that was one of the main reasons. And especially, uh, like in the early YouTube days, like around 2014, no, not that 2014 is not early, like around 20. 11 2012 over there there were so many campaigns on cyberbullying it was crazy like you'd go into the comment section of youtube and you would be shocked like you would be shocked and you'd ask yourself is it a person behind these words like is there a person behind this word and i know right now right now is not the time to talk about happiness especially with what is going on in the world however one truth that I know is that uh, all the trolling, all the bad comments that I people were getting really affected my thoughts on about YouTube. And I just thought I can never post like that. That was my mindset at that time, though. I really wanted to. But my mindset was like, oh, my God, how will I face all these people? So um, basically what I'm trying to say is um if you've always wanted to post, just know that haters will always be there. there. There's no time they're going to end. So you might as well just whip out your camera like I did this year. I just whipped it out and I started posting and I was like, 
no i have to spread some love spread some goodness spread some cheer you know and be patriotic to my country you know <laughs> there are very few youtubers in kenya by the way because Mm, I've been on YouTube for a long time and I've seen by the way the YouTube community in Kenya is growing and I'm so happy for the people who are YouTubers by the way in Kenya. You guys are doing us good. You're doing us proud. It doesn't matter what content you have because I know for a fact that people watch anything and everything on YouTube. I have seen people breaking eggs on their hair. I've seen people eating food for five people just to get views and you know they are not just getting views they're also satisfying somebody's hunger to watch that so even if you're a potter somebody wants to learn how to make a pot if you're a painter somebody wants to learn how to paint i'm creating content because um self-gratification like i always wanted to post content in those early days like 2009 2010 i mean i don't think anyone even knew that youtubers get paid honestly they nobody knew so personally i've always just wanted to post content like i always just wanted to do it so uh i'm doing it for the self gratification but if there's a reward at the end why not so uh what i can say the second truth about youtube is <clears throat> my friends they work like basically they put in effort they work i've ever edited a video for about one hour and then it disappeared you know by the way i do have an eight to five job a very demanding one like even if the country goes on lockdown i'm not on lockdown but uh the 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 guys who um post i'm telling you they work like you can take about uh two hours to film and then you can take about an hour to three hours just editing and i've had youtubers who are saying like they, they've edited their video for 15 hours honestly guys youtubers really really work like they work like it's not a joke they work like by the time you're editing a video for about two days it means you've really put in work like i edit videos and i know what it means like honestly they work so it's not something that you can say oh this guy is just going beca behind the camera and then he's just like talking 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 and then earning cash or something of the sort no like it's a job they actually work and by the time you're getting any good pay on youtube you've really put in effort like you've put in effort but that's not a a factor i can say can really stop somebody from posting because to be honest uh it's it's something that somebody enjoys i mean you're doing what you enjoy doing most of the time if you're a content creator you're creating content based on what you love doing if you love doing for example makeup you post content to do with makeup if you love doing um food if you love eating food you post content to do with food if you love um tech you post content to do it tech. so guys basically i wanted to tell you the truth like if you're a kenyan and you're thinking of joining youtube at least i've gotten it out there so guys basically this video was just to encourage you guys it was actually an encouragement video it wasn't a video supposed to scare you no it, I, I was just trying to show you that one it's never too late yeah because me, I've started YouTube after having my channel for a whole 10 years or more. And secondly, um, as an African, I mean, we have so much to offer, like so much, like so, 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 so much. People are literally traveling all the way to Africa to film things. Although we know that sometimes they do film negative things, but I've been seeing YouTubers at least portraying Africa in a better light, Kidogo, not so negative but basically we have so much to offer and if you're like an african and you're watching these guys please pick up your camera pick up your phone pick up whatever you have and you know show us your content we'll watch it i've watched some ridiculous videos that honestly gave me no benefit but they did give me benefit they did give me some dopamine some pleasure so 
guys pick up your phones actually the final truth about youtube is that you're not going to go on youtube and post although of course i'm sure you've done your research and you've known that um right now in order for you to be paid a single coin from youtube you have to have four thousand watch hours like four thousand people should have watched your videos for four thousand hours so if you have a five minute long video my friend they should have watched it i don't know how many times in order to reach those four thousand watch hours so and not only that, you also have to have a thousand subscribers in order for you to get a single coin from YouTube. And in my head, I'm thinking, why aren't we paid to like and comment? But anyway, <laughs> so um, basically, once you reach that threshold is when you can apply to to be paid. Yeah. And uh, I hope I'm going to get to that point. I nearly forgot to include this. Those 4,000 watch hours should have been in the past one year. So if you have 4,000 watch hours over three years, my friend, you're not going to get a single coin. It has to be 4,000 watch hours within one year. So basically, you have to be like uploading each and every week. That's why I was telling you YouTubers really work. So generally you cannot get rich quick you know it's not the kind of thing you'll be like oh my god let me just post on youtube and get rich quick it's the same like those people who write books and then they're just like oh let me post on amazon kindle oh and then i'll get rich quick no it's not that easy and but we are all about positivity positivity the positive side to this is that eventually eventually guys eventually that's why i'm encouraging you post upload that video somebody somewhere is going to watch it several times and people somewhere are going to watch it several times so positivity guys the bottom line is once you've met that threshold that youtube wants you to meet eh? that threshold of 4000 watch hours and a thousand subscribers i'm telling you the only thing your income from YouTube will be doing will be increasing. That's a fact. Like, I don't think it can reverse. Like, now it can start going, you earned $500 this, $500 this month, and then next month you're earning less. I don't think that's what will happen. Definitely, once you start post-earning, it will always be increasing. So, yeah. So, basically, I hope you are encouraged. As far as I'm concerned, guys, Post, post your content, post your content, my friends. We want to see it. And also, be positive, be positive. Like, no, we should stop using that word positive. Be, be happy, be on the good side, the bright side. Yeah, be on the bright side. Yeah, be on the bright side. I hope you are encouraged by this video. Make sure to subscribe and to like this video. Guys, subscribe. You've just had a thousand subscribers. Then I get some coin. Some coin for editing my videos for three hours a day. <laughs> anyway, uh, make sure you like this video. Subscribe to my channel. And you can also comment down below if this wig suits me or not, if I should ditch it or not, if I should stop posting or not. Any comment will be appreciated. Even a dislike will be appreciated. The algorithm doesn't know. It doesn't care whether it's a like, whether it's a dislike. It will still consider us relating. We are relating. We are relating to each other. We are, we are having relations. So um, make sure you subscribe like this video and comment thank you so much for watching this video to the end if you made it this far be blessed be blessed and be blessed again